So, you may have seen my art books, but today I'm going to show you guys my large scales. Hey guys, and welcome back to my face, and today, hopefully, you will come out of this video with some inspiration for your own large scales, because I'm going to be showing you mine from year 10. Now, these ones aren't the best. I do have better ones that I did in year 11, and I will be showing you guys them next week, so don't forget to go down and click that subscribe button to see those. But today, you're going to be seeing sort of my first attempt at doing large pieces of work final pieces. They didn't actually count towards my final grade, but I still got full UMS 200 out of 200, so they may have picked up some any, some any, what? Some leftover marks that I couldn't get with my year 11 work. So yeah, we'll just get straight into showing you those. Okay guys, so this is the first piece. It is emulsion and graphite. So as you can see, it's kind of got like a texture to it because I painted the whole page with emulsion, just plain white emulsion. And while it was still wet, I actually got a really thick crayon, crayon, sorry, charcoal pencil and I etched in the outlines and a lot of the uh, detail in it. And that's what made sort of the texture look. I don't know if you can see, can you see? Yeah. And then afterwards I went over with just a normal pencil and filled in for all the detail and everything So yeah, and that is actually a teddy bear and the thing over it is like meant to be glad wrap I don't know if you can tell and that's just from a picture that I took this one right here actually next I have this which is just black tissue paper stuck onto white paper And then I use bleach to make all the lighter bits so that yellowy kind of color That is the black tissue paper bleached. We literally just dipped in a a brush to get the general shape of all the objects on here and then I went in for more detail with a fine sort of toothpick like long toothpick thing but bleach is really hard to control so what we did later to actually add in the detail is draw on with oil pastel so it's black oil pastel and we have some white oil pastel as well but not as much it's mostly just the black oil pastel to give the definition and the outlines and this again is also from a photo that I've drawn it's this one right here so that's the dog and that's the stone man in the background next is this and it's just on white paper and I've stuck some tissue paper to create some texture around the edges and then just did the background first with a green and yellow water watercolor wash or acrylic wash I can't really remember and then went over the top and drew in the teddy bear and painted that with black and white acrylic paint but obviously as you can see I sort of left the lighter areas to allow some color to come through and they sort of act as highlights as well as the white paint and I think this is quite fun to do and this was from this photo right here and I did an experiment with two different ones but I decided I like that color better next I have this piece which is literally just the same white paper with some tissue paper covering it completely do you once again create that texture because the examiners seem to like that and then I literally just went over it with an ochre colored paint so it kind of looks like coffee stained really washed out and then I went in and drew the teddy bear with some black crayon not crayon oil pastel and then went back in over with some watercolor paint maybe it was acrylic I can't really remember but I did like it reds and pinks there and then the background I did blue and that just sort of creates a really sort of interesting effect and this is from this photo right here now guys there are actually a couple more pieces they're actually like 3d and I can't seem to find them I'm gonna ask my mom when she comes home but if I can't find them I can't find them and there's also an oil painting which I really want to show you guys because I think I really like the oil painting it's my favorite large scale out of all of my year 10 large scales so I'll try and find that for you okay I found it guys this is the oil painting that I've done I actually really like it it's my favorite piece out of my year 10 collection of large scales uh, it took me forever as you can see it's quite detailed the egg actually had a lot more detail in it but I just like the sort of shading effect like the ombre kind of but anyway yeah that, 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 that's it <laughs> Okay guys, and that is the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you got some inspiration from it. If you did, don't forget to go down below and hit that big like button, give it a big thumbs up, and subscribe, of course, to see some more of my face, to see some more art videos, to see some study videos, perhaps some university videos, because as you're watching this, I will probably be probably can't speak English, as you can tell. <laughs> I will probably be I will probably be off in university because I'm actually filming this way in the past. I'm still at my old house in Dubai because this is where my large scales are, so I need to show you guys them. So yeah, if you want to see some of my university journey, anything to do with uni, my room tour, anything like that, then also click that little red button. You know you want to. <laughs> anyway, guys, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you soon in the next video. Bye! You up in boom, 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 bo